Hey everyone, welcome back to the Red Carpet Reup. Today we're diving into the latest chapter in the long running feud between 50 Cent and Rick Ross. This time, 50 Cent had a field day trolling Rick Ross after an unfortunate incident with Drake fans in Canada. Let's break it all down. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more exclusive content. On June 28th at the Ignite Music Festival in Vancouver, Rick Ross and his entourage found themselves in a heated confrontation with Drake supporters. The clash happened backstage after Ross's crew played Kendrick Lamar's diss track, Not Like Us. Words were exchanged, and things quickly escalated when one of Drake's fans sucker punched Rick Ross, leading to a full-blown brawl. 50 Cent wasted no time reacting to the incident. He jumped on Instagram Live with Keith Sweat and comedian Earthquake, laughing hysterically and making light of Ross's misfortune. You know what I'm saying? You saw that shit. Like, in Canada, Rick Ross got fucked up, man. All his bodyguards need to resign, nigga. Bro, them bro, niggas, bro. They failed the number one thing. They ain't got nobody body, including <laughs> their own. Son, I mean, son, my nigga just stayed son, down there, bitch, and kept letting them. Yeah, it's a thing, right? <laughs> <laughs> Something ain't right. He even posted a parody reenactment video featuring a Rick Ross lookalike, further mocking the situation. In one post, 50 Cent shared footage of Rick Ross fleeing the scene, captioning it, The Great Escape, Mika Call the Chasers, They Are Chasing Me, LOL. Yeah, nigga! They don't know what we do! Shut it off! Hey, shut shit off, nigga! Shut it off! Shut it off, shit, nigga! I can play what I want to play, nigga! You disrespecting us in our city, change the song! Shut up, nigga! Hold on, nigga! It's on now, nigga! Oh, hey, shit! Hey, this what no, fuck that. For. Look, I go left, you go I right. Come on. For times like this, to shine like this, in the path of time like spin on the lock up, shit, in the back of a padded lock, stuck, locked on me, in the back of a, Bro. my dick get bold, my head's too, but I'm trying to Bro. make a game, unless I say, yeah, I do, if you want to see it, you see it, but it could I do. Like I said, I chew like a nigga sneeze. Red bees took it from the knees. Of yeah, started. yeah, nigga. Red nigga wanna talk about it with what we started. Blood. Hold on, wait, wait, wait. We gotta get out of here, nigga. Every day I'm hustling. Every yeah. day, nigga. Every day. Oh. <laughs> we on the jet now, nigga. Want a wing? Hell no, nah, man. You let us get whooped out there. Where you was at? I was around, nigga. I was swinging. I spit the nigga around. Hit two niggas. Man, you didn't do nothing, man. Your homie almost died. I had to drag him out the alley. You're supposed to, nigga. We don't leave nobody behind. See, so I got to call the dream chasers. I'm going to take my dream chasers next time. You niggas not ready. Man, Meek Mill ain't on shit, man. Me, where he was at? I don't know, but y'all was wildin', man. I'm going to just give you a promotion, nigga. You want to be a manager at Wingstop, nigga? Man, hell no, man. Hey, pilot, take us back to Miami, nigga. He didn't stop there. Reposting a video from Rick Ross's ex-girlfriend, Tia Kemp, who also mocked Ross for throwing no blows. In a follow-up video, 50 Cent sarcastically expressed concern for Rick Ross and his crew, hoping they made it home safely and learned a valuable lesson. This trolling has sparked a lot of reactions online, with fans of both rappers weighing in on the feud. It's another example of 50 Cent's knack for stirring the pot and keeping his rivalries in the spotlight. So that's the latest on the 50 Cent and Rick Ross saga. It's clear that 50 Cent knows how to keep his audience entertained, 
even at the expense of his rivals. What do you think about this latest feud? Let us know in the comments below. And remember, for more updates on your favorite hip hop stars, hit that subscribe button and ring the bell for notifications. Thanks for watching the Red Carpet Reup.